Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So, just got home from work, literally changed out of my work shirt and put this shirt on. But on my way home, I stopped and I bought something. And I'm gonna show you guys. So, the air is on inside here, so it might sound a little bit loud. But I bought, let me turn this over. I bought a shampoo from Amazon, which came today. But I bought two items at Rainbow that I'm super excited about. Who made me realize that? Um, Rainbow had a brand that Fashion Nova carries. Boy, was I excited when I realized that. So, let me turn the air off. So the wax jeans, right? I bought these jeans from Fashion Nova before. And I even have them in a try-on haul on here. And I'm like, wait a minute. I know these are not the same jeans that I bought from Fashion Nova. They are. So I bought two because I've been feeling like I need a little bit more ripped jeans. So I bought this one that's like barely really ripped. You know, just slight rips. Hopefully I don't already own this. And then I got this one that's like pretty ripped on it. And then the ends are frayed like this. I've been wanting a pair like this and I've seen it on Fashion Nova for $40. So I'm going to try these on up, see if I even like them. The laundry's here, which is dope. Oh, and I bought this jeans jacket too. I did try it on slightly inside of this store to see if it fits me. Because I already have one, but it's... It has something on there. I need to now get a light one, so I have three. This is super cute, no? So cute. Love that. So we're definitely keeping that. And listen, I'm the person who normally like throws the receipts and stuff away, but I made sure that I kept this because I'm just like, listen, if these jeans are not fitting, I'm taking them back. But I knew that they would fit me because, like I said, I bought this brand from Fashion Nova before. So I just bought the same size and I'm pretty consistent with my sizes. Let's try this one on and see how it fits. This one is my absolute favorite, so I just hope it fits me. And these jeans are very, very stretchy, like super stretchy. The other day I was telling my friend about them too, that I've seen the same jeans that I bought from Fashion Nova at Rainbow. Which is, was unbelievable at the time. Oh, oh my gosh. Love that. I'll put y'all back some more. Guys. How cute is that? Well, it fits me. And it's high-waisted. Just now I was wondering. Okay, I absolutely love this. Looks so nice on and I'm gonna try the other one on off camera because obviously this fits so chances are the other one is gonna fit because they are indeed the same company so I don't see why it wouldn't but yeah it's what I bought at Rainbow I'm gonna turn the air conditioner back on because it's, it's hot so hot but um I just wanted to pop in and show you guys what I bought I'm off tomorrow which I'm super excited about okay I have some things on my skin and I bought the shampoo medicated shampoo to like get rid of them so i'm gonna try this one on now and see how i like it hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel i just woke up literally just rolled out of bed eyes are mad puffy and everything still and i really don't know what i'm gonna be doing today today's my last day off for this week i'm not i said i wanted to go take a walk this morning but i'm let me tell you these mornings have been hot as hell i'm gonna have to set a reminder for like four or five o'clock to like go take a little walk and that be it because the mornings are as soon as you wake up it's hot as hell so i don't know because even yesterday when i was going to work like i was walking right out the block there and it was dumb hot and i'm just like oh my gosh it's so hot i can't <laughs> vlogging on my phone too even though my camera is sitting right there like i already had the phone in my hand and i'm just like well this is easy so yeah i don't really have any huge plans for today because i had already meal prepped for this whole week so i don't have to do that right now even though i don't know what next week is gonna look like so maybe i should cook something today 
but you know if i am that's gonna be a little bit later on in the day because like i said right now it's eight o'clock it's not even nine o'clock yet probably nine o'clock at this point but it's still so early you know so i don't know because tomorrow is saturday and i don't know if i'm gonna be working sunday so if i am gonna be working sunday then i'd need lunch for sunday but for right now like I, the lunch that I currently have works because I'm not gonna, um, for the amount of days that I'm working for. I feel like this week, this coming week, the week starts on a Sunday at my job. So this coming week, I'm gonna work that week and then I'm gonna let my manager know that I'm gonna need three days off the following week because those three days are gonna be the orientation at the nursing home that I'm possibly gonna be working at. So I wanna get those three days off. I could very well just tell him that those are the day offs that I want for that week and that just be it which he would be getting some good days because technically he likes when i work on the weekends because those are normally the busier times like friday obviously well friday is up in the air because today is friday and i am off and i've been off on a saturday before so yeah but i'm gonna tell him that next week and then the week after i'll be doing the orientation and then hopefully after the orientation is when i'll know like what's up like you gonna get the job or not you know so there is that and i'm very very excited because you know the turnaround time has just been so quick from the time that i went there and filled out the papers to the time that they've actually called me back and said oh hey this is going to be the orientation or whatever so i'm very very excited and today i'm going to brush up on watching like some skills just so that i'm up to date because it's been a minute so i'm definitely going to do that while i add videos to my queue on the tv to watch today because that's generally how i watch videos and stuff i'm gonna have i'm gonna add bits and bobs of that type of videos here and there like after every normal video that i would watch i'll add a skill so you know i don't feel like i'm just sitting down watching skills fully overwhelmed or anything no yesterday as i'm messing with my braids yesterday i was gonna buy hair to like add to my braids hair and everything to make them a little bit heavier and then in the last second i just changed my mind i was also gonna buy hair dye but changed my mind about that too so now it's because the hair likes to just stick up like that. But if I had some more hair onto it, it would be heavier and like stay where I want it to stay. But for the most part, it's fine. It's not that serious. I pin it up in the back anyway. So that's one of the reasons why I ended up changing my mind because I'm just like, well, however I take it, I pin it up in the back. So it really is not that serious. So there's that. But I ended up buying some things to hold me over because if I'm not going to go back to work, then I'm maximizing the discounts that I get. So I bought another container of gel. The one that I have right now is one of the bigger ones and that lasted me a hot, hot minute. I think I've had that for over two years at this point because, you know, when I do use gel, I use a small amount. So I bought two of the smaller size containers because my job does not have that big one that I had bought the last time. And I bought some deodorant because I used a Dove spray deodorant. And wow, one normally lasts me like a month or six weeks. So I bought five and I had already had three. So that should last me a good eight, nine months or whatever. We'll see. Because I just started using one too. So I just stocked up on some like little essential items that I know that I'm gonna need as time progresses but I'd get the discount on it at work I bought some hairpins too because I find that I have the huge ones and I just want some tiny ones to like pin up the braids and stuff like that so I bought one container of that at work I bought a tweezer because not I can't find the tweezer that I had before for nothing at all like it's like the tweezer got legs and walked away I don't know where it is so I bought a tweezer I have a few more little things on my list that I think Eventually, I'm going to buy like an emery board and a base coat and like a gel top coat because eventually I'll need those. But I'm not quite sure yet if, you know, at the nursing home, I'll be able to wear my nails actually done. My friend said it, but I don't want to be the person who goes up in there with that done, not knowing if I can actually wear it. So, you know, you have to feel things out first and then eventually that will come. So that's that. But I wanted to make sure that I was stocked up on the hair product because who knows? So I think I'm going to buy one more little thing that I use on my hair to like moisturize it and stuff like that. And then, oh, I also bought a got to be gel because the got to be gel is what's on my hair right now. Keeping it laid like this, even though I slept in it last night, even though I slept in my bonnet. But still, because when I do something like this, I want this to last me all week. I don't want to get up every single day and like have to do it over again. Like I'm too lazy. Mm -mm. We can't do that. But this was very easy for me because I did this straight out of the shower. Anyways, I'm about to go set up my queue on the TV and like watch some TV for a couple hours. And yeah, hopefully I do something interesting and I'll come back.